Hey everybody, this is a real quick video. In case you have a squeeze box duet and you need to do a hard reset to the factory default settings on the controller. Um, you might want to do this on the controller for one of two reasons. The first one is if it's not connecting to the receiver or if it's otherwise like not responding, if it seems frozen um, and stuff like that. You know, any kind of troubleshooting issues that you're trying to fix can very often be fixed with this hard reset. Um, the second reason you might want to do this is if you're setting it up in a new network on a new device and you just want to kind of get a fresh start on everything, we can just go ahead and do this um, forced reset to the uh, factory defaults. All we need to do is, first of all, if it's on or if it's stuck on, we're just going to come and press and long hold the, this home button or power button for 12 seconds, and that will force it to power down no matter what happens. And then with it powered down, we're just going to come in and we're going to press and hold the, this plus button or the add button. And while pressing it, we're just going to press the home button to turn it on um, while pressing this add button. And if this works right, the, the button lights will flash and the controller will then turn on. Um, just keep holding this plus button until the Logitech logo appears on the display. Then you can release the button and then you can go ahead and set this controller up like a new controller.